Welcome to Tuscany. I've come here today to drive the Aston Martin DB11. So I'm going to tell you a little bit about this modern British sports car, as well as what life is like here in this gorgeous part of Italy. So let's talk briefly about the car. The DB11, it's a riot to drive, as you would expect. 600 horsepower, new platform, 8-speed automatic transmission. It's a great blend of Aston's heritage. It looks like James Bond's car, certainly, but it's also a modern car. There's some technology borrowed from Mercedes-Benz in there, and certainly if you're an enthusiast, this car is worth checking out. For more of this, you got to read my whole review. Everything you want to know about this car, it's in there. But right now, I'm going to tell you a little bit about some of the area where I've been driving the car and where I'm actually staying. I'm staying in this fantastic villa. It's actually at the top of the hill, uh, overlooking, you know, basically this great vista. You can see parts of Siena. The main building here dates to 1400. Think about that. Buildings in the United States, they're old if they're from like the turn of the 1900s. The main place here, 1400. So uh, this morning, set out on the road with the DB11. The car was uh, more than up for the challenges of uh, Italian driving. There's a lot of stuff going on around here. There's carts, there's trucks, there's farmers, there's all kinds of things. Midway through the day, I stopped at a pretty interesting place for lunch. Uh, had some great food. I actually made my own pasta. Talk about experiencing Italian culture firsthand. Had some great meats and cheeses as well. Uh, side note about this trip, uh, before I got to Tuscany, I actually went to an area just outside of London. Uh, I stayed in this great house. Uh, it was an, a hotel called Luton Hu. I think I'm pronouncing that correctly. Another really old building. Uh, hey, there you go. There's a V12 firing up in the background. Uh, you know, that soundtrack, it's amazing. But uh, remember, Aston's a British sports car company, and uh, I think it was fitting that I spent uh, you know, a night in the London area, you know, had a good dinner in a room with a portrait of Winston Churchill overlooking me. And, uh, you know, definitely sort of set the tone like the exhaust note does here for an Aston Martin trip. Uh, so there we go. On location here in Tuscany, Italy, the side trip to London for Autoblog. I'm Greg Migliori.